So yeah, this is Ohio's spicy chicken burger. I don't think it's dipped in. It might have a spicy, spicy butter. I've just licked my fingers. It's more like a sweet kind of a chili than a, a spicy chili. But yeah, this is crunchy fried chicken. Ohio fried chicken, my first time. Here we go. Dry, Not very dry. Crunchy but dry. The mayo isn't saving it, unfortunately. Crunchy fried chicken. Here we go. Ah. Ah. Spicy is a weird one. The spice is a very weird one. It's like, it's more like it's sweet and then it's a little bit spicy. So it's like a sweet chili. Dead. The fries are dead. Ooh, the verdict. Who's the winner? Yes, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new episode of Halal Munchies. So today's a different video. I'm on the Wimslow Road. Two, I would say probably two of the more, the least popular spicy chicken burger shops would be Crunchy Fried Chicken and Ohio's Fried Chicken. So yeah, these two are probably the most, at least popular I'd say compared to your Miamis and Phillies and whatnot. But I thought, let me do a versus battle. Let me see, maybe why are they unpopular? Why, do, why, don't, why aren't they people's first choice? Well, it's evident that, you know, this, the caliber the level of spicy chicken burgers here is through the roof. So Ohio's versus crunchy fried chicken. This should be an interesting one. I'm assuming they can't be that bad. Does that make sense? They can't be that bad. But nonetheless, if you're new here, be sure to like, comment and subscribe. Follow the Instagram, follow the TikTok and let's get into this battle. So guys, on first impressions, honestly, it looks good, man. It looks good. Even uh, sauce coverage, as you can see just there. Um, I've just licked my fingers. It's more like a sweet kind of a chili than a, a spicy chili. But yeah, this is Crunchy Fried Chicken's spicy chicken burger. Let's see how it compares to Ohio's. So first and foremost, Ohio's, well done. You packed it in uh, aluminum foil, so it keeps it nice and warm. It's actually really, really warm in there. I like that. So yeah, this is Ohio's spicy chicken burger. I don't think it's dipped in. It might have a spicy, spicy butter um, from what he's told me inside the shop. I spoke to the brother. He's like, yeah, we have a spicy butter. But I've just like, you know, texture wise, that's incredibly crispy compared to um, the others. I'm assuming it would be because it hasn't been dipped in. But yeah, I think this one looks a bit better than the crunchy fried chicken. So appearance wise, I think, I think this one's winning. Okay, guys, let's get into the Ohio's first and foremost. I think looking at it from the inspection perspective, yeah, there's a lot of mayo, like a loads. And the, the mayo, from what I'm looking, is seasoned. So it might be garlic mayo. I'm not too sure. It's definitely seasoned. It's very, very crispy. Very, very crispy. I don't think it's dipped, though. But it might have a spicy batter, which that might make this battle unfair, if that makes sense. Ohio fried chicken, my first time. Here we go. Dry. Not very dry. Crunchy but dry. The mayo isn't saving it, unfortunately. So I just took a big piece of the chicken burger right now. That is juicy, but a lot of it's dry. So it's a very inconsistency. It's very inconsistent, I'd say. And regarding um, the actual, look, it's absolutely plastered. Can you see that? Absolutely plastered with mayo. Mixed reviews. Some of it's juicy, some of it's dry. The mayo's got a nice kick to it, actually. Probably one of the nicer mayos I've tasted. However, it's not spicy. So this must be their normal version. So I think price-wise, if you look at this, and um, crunchy fried chicken, I think this burger was about $4.99. And the other one was about five pounds thirty for a meal, so there's a big price difference. This one's a bit more pricier. Uh, it's okay, nothing to shout about. Um, yeah, that's Ohio's fried chicken, spicy chicken burger, spicy chicken burger. So guys, let's now move on to crunchy fried chicken. And I don't know if you've heard before. I said it's like I'm trying to. It's like a sweet chili. It's not. It's not like a chili chili. It's like a sweet chili. Oh well. Let's give it a taste. Hopefully the chicken is really nice and juicy, unlike the other one. Here we go. Ah, ah. Not juicy, not dry, just normal like. The spice is a weird one. The spice is a very weird one. It's like, 
it's not incredibly spicy it doesn't absolutely like attack your mouth it's more like it's sweet and then it's a little bit spicy so it's like a sweet chili i don't i don't like this one no i don't like the spice on this one at all no it's okay like for five quid for five pounds thirty for the meal or something like that i don't rate it no i don't rate both of them to be honest i'm just nibbling on some chips dead the fries are dead wow this has been a disappointing episode of halal Mundries. hopefully i've entertained you a little bit <laughs> right i'm looking at the spicy chicken burger and it's like it's got a lot of seasonings got herbs i can see everything on there but it's just it's not it's not packing a punch i wouldn't say that is a munch no it's none of that it's just uh, you know what we say alhamdulillah for food can't complain but yeah guys that's a very quick episode of halal munchies Ooh. The verdict, who's the winner? I mean, there has to be a winner, right? Unfortunately, <laughs> they were both pretty poor. Who should I call a winner? I don't know. This is a, normally it's like night and day. Like you can clearly distinguish who's a winner and who's a loser. But these are making me think for all the wrong reasons. And do you know why it's extra difficult? Because like Ohio's, some of the chicken was really juicy. Some of the chicken was really dry. So it was very inconsistent. Overall, crunchy fried chicken was okay. Not dry, not juicy. Sauce was a bit sweet strange not a big celebration but i'm gonna go with ohio yeah i'm gonna go with ohio but then that wasn't even a spicy chicken burger it wasn't dipped in but it had a little bit of a spice on the butter ohio is the winner for me so guys thank you so much for watching i'd really appreciate if you could like comment and subscribe follow the instagram and follow the tiktok and yeah you know what we've got i don't know if you can see just there serious sweets i love their baklava and we've got cha cha chai or something like that Apparently they do good, good milk cakes and donuts. Might try them. I'll catch you guys in the next one.